okay, another day out of the mountain. I'm not going to buy the bike. But once doing the conversion, it's just going to come out to be just a little too much. I was close. I was really close. Uh, but no, I worked it out after the conversion. I, I'd be spending just too much money for this bike. Uh, and, uh, in comparison to when I bought mine three years ago. Uh, what's this person doing? You gotta stop. Okay, I'm falling into habits. Uh, I know there's a better way of getting there, but this is the way I got here the first day. So it's the way I take. Uh, we got a really windy day today. Started off nice, but as you can see, See, we got some clouds blowing in. Okay, first things first, let's get some petrol. Dogs. Okay. So, uh, if everything works out today, we're actually off to Castletown. Okay. Not too fast, or we'll be driving under a cloud. So as normal, uh, no rain gear. I hate rain gear. Just get wet, go home, dry off. Oh, red light, red light. Okay. So yeah, this is currently part of the TT and I actually I think I figured out the turn I keep doing wrong. For the TT course, it'd be the next right hand turn. Should have been painted engine. Okay, right and then a left.
because we actually want to go to Castletown and try to find the airport. Only got a few days left here. Oh, I'm on right. I got right away. Okay, that's the one I would have wanted for the TT. Okay, straight on through. Uh, what we're looking for is an industrial, oops. An industrial just before the airport. If I hit Castletown, I've gone too far. If I pass the airport, I've gone too far. Now, aren't those just the coolest vehicles? They are just too damn cool. some signs here. I'm still... I have no idea. So, just cause I have no idea. that building. Watch your road, watch your road. Whatever it is, it's very weird looking. Okay, watch your roads. 
these are just bad ideas. Concrete blocks in the middle of the road, why would they do that? the truck. Corner coming up, stay in lane. Island is when I've been actually in town. Okay, we got the airport. Okay, so we did it right. Now, uh, I just got to figure out. How to find what I need. I don't think that was it. a little here. Okay, what's going on people? Oh, okay. Traffic jam at the corner. Nothing coming up behind us. Uh, 
just got to find that entrance I came out of the other day. This is the dry run to get the bike back to where I rented it from. Oh. Was it this one? I think it was. Hey, we did it! Okay, now... And Merritt. Okay. Uh, that should be a bike shop right there. Jason Griffiths. Once again, we're back at Jason Griffiths here, and uh, let's do a, do a comparison. Jason Griffiths motorcycles. Now, bike here, ten thousand pounds for an, a GSF8 uh, BMW. Fuck, be nice, but too damn expensive. So, a Triumph Daytona 675, 92. And that sucker's coming in at 10.5. 7.5. 5. Not too bad, how about you? Having fun, having a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, could be a little better weather, but I got good, uh, what was that, two days ago. Th that was kind of cold, but still nice. Yeah, just a, a little rain, but hey, no worries. Uh, well. Uh, as long as, uh, Guinness, though, as long as he's got a good bike, man, look out. And he loves those courts, you know, he does so good on it, it's just fucking amazing. Get it? <laughs> yeah. So you think Hutchison's ever going to win again? I mean, I was a flash in the pan, to be honest. Think so? Yeah. Okay. I think the way everything was, and people were right here, McGinnis had problems. Stars lining up just right, just for that. It just fell in, fell in place. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's a you know, he's, he's talented driver, he's good at I think with his leg injuries and everything, I don't, I can't see, you know, results that you'll, you'll come back in. Yeah. Well, you'll be competitive, though, you'll feel better. No, so true. I was, I was surprised he limped so bad now. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm I haven't seen him recently, I don't know. Yeah. Is he bad? Have you seen him? Yeah, uh, just because uh, I've had a similar break with my leg yeah. and the whole bit. But just watching him, um, yeah. the way, you know, when he first came out, I don't know if he was just forcing himself not to limp for cameras, yeah. but then you notice him a couple years later, and wow, it's like, holy shit, very pronounced. Yeah. yeah. It's been quite bad breaking, isn't it? Yeah, no, it wasn't a good one, that's for sure. Did you see it on, have you seen it on the crash? Uh, yeah. Like, yeah, we were you? Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> I've done one of those, man. It, it's ugly when you... When it's not, it doesn't look nice, does it? No, not at all. <laughs> no, that's, that's not nice at all, really. No, no, definitely not. <laughs> so this place just, uh, Ireland must go crazy during the TT. Yeah. I mean, it's my first year working with Jason. I was, I was working for uh, my Honda okay. uh, in 08. And he was uh, a lot busier. I mean, we're coming four franchises. It's, it's, it's busy. I can imagine. <laughs> 2007 was the busiest they ever had. Oh really? Yeah, yeah it was really, well it was a century year, wasn't it? So they had so many people in the island, it was so busy. So true. It was good boys though, you know, more, more than So that. what do you ride then? Yeah, I've got a steel frame Honda, I raced, I raced that up with the local track in Derby. Oh okay, gotcha. I hope to do the ranks this year, but depending on finance really, and just Great. signatures as well, I need to get one more signature. Okay, just for a race license? So I can get my mountain course license, yeah. Okay. 
Looking forward to it. <laughs> What's it take to get a signature? Jeez, a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. And at least two years of writing. Uh -huh. You know, doing, and then you've got to get, you've got to get within 110 percent of the finish time. Yeah. I mean, I was, I was winning and stuff in my class, and I won, I won in England as well. So you know, I was getting sort of, you know, getting good results to get the signatures. Gotcha. You've got to get, I think it's 10, 10 signatures on 10 separate race days. Holy shit. You've got shit. to fill your card in, send it in, and then they give you a course license. And you've got to have the course license for, I think it's three months, you've got to have the TT course license and do three races beforehand for the to the banks. Okay, so gotcha. It's quite, it's quite difficult to get it, but... Yeah, I know, it takes you all. Depending on what class you do. I mean, right. I've run a steel frame Honda, so it's not, you know, the class wasn't, you know, it wasn't that bad. Either. It was competitive. <laughs> oh yeah. Don't be wrong, it was competitive. Always. Always. So has a Canadian ever won the TT? I don't think a Canadian ever has, have they? I don't know, you'd have to ask Dace on that one, I'm not sure. Okay, no, I will. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. So you were embraced the TT? Yeah. Okay, and you actually came in second. Uh, a few times, yeah, and third, but no win. No win? No win. Okay, so what, what classes do you race? Uh, I raced during my time here, I raced in everything, basically from, two, well, 250, two strokes through to... Okay, they don't have the 250 class no, anymore, it's gone do now. they? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's up yeah. to the 600, is it? It's or? now 600, um, Super Sport 600, yeah. and then uh, Superbike, which is a 1,000cc. Okay. And they have a super stock 1,000 race as well. Right. Yeah. Okay, so what would uh, the senior, what kind of bike would that be? That's um, predominantly... Uh, the super bikes in the, in a, you know they do two races they yeah. do a super bike race and then they do the senior race. So what's the difference between the bikes, the super bike and the senior bike? What is the difference? Uh, Anything? Not really. I mean the senior you could bring something still. I think like uh, you know it's giving them room to put a GP bike in there or something like that. Ah. You know, it's got the scope to do something different. But you find the front guys are riding the same bike as they've ridden in the super bike race. Okay, no, yeah, that, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. So what can't you do to a bike in uh, the GT or TT? Um, basically, they're running to um, in line with with international rules, you know, so that it's open for gotcha. guys to come from other countries, and and the specification allows them to take part with their bike. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. So, uh, do you still race? No. No. Why not? No. Finished uh, end of two thousand six. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Must have been fun. It's good, yeah. I mean, it's, you've ridden around it, so yes, I mean, it's, it's not the beautiful. best time of year, but it's, yeah, there's nothing better. Yeah. No, it's actually yeah. pretty cool yeah. uh, riding around and just seeing where these guys are going yeah. 200 yeah. miles an hour. Yeah. That yeah. is cool in yeah. itself. Yeah. No, it's, uh, I mean, obviously, in better weather, you'd enjoy it more. But, yes. Uh, yeah. yeah. But it's, no, it's a great place to ride a motorcycle. And I also got a talk from, uh, from someone. You know, we live here, this isn't that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is our home. Yeah, 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 lot, yeah, so. yeah, yeah. I'm trying not to be too crazy. No, no. Just, just having yeah, fun. Yeah, no, it's, uh, I mean, obviously when there's 10,000 bikes here in June, it's totally different. Yeah. But yeah. No, no and that's why I didn't want to, I didn't want to come when everybody yeah, else is here. Yeah, it's good to come outside. It's, I mean, it, everybody to visit the TT one time is, you know, should be on you. I bucket list or definitely whatever, yeah. Yeah. I want to do it. Yeah. So I was talking to you guys got someone working downstairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And actually better. He was saying Gert, Guy Martin doesn't race much anymore. Um Guy he doesn't he does probably I don't know, seven or eight races in a year I guess, yeah. Not a massive amount of racing, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. He's a big TV star now, you see. No, that's true. <laughs> Ever since uh, Closer to the Edge, that. Yeah, but he's doing stuff in the UK now that. Um, oh. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's sort of, oh, okay. Yeah. So he's actually a TV personality. Now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You know, okay. Building canal boats and stuff like that, yeah. No way. Yeah, yeah. No, he's, he's, uh, he's cracked TV now, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> far, that's a, a far way to come from being a mechanic. It is. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, he still does a little bit of that as well. I think the TV pays a lot better. Oh, definitely. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Well, uh, once he, I knew so. Once he got the contract with Suzuki, that's probably when he started making the big money. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. And started moving away. Yeah, and yeah. No, he's got some good, I think, you know, Dionysi contracts. I stuff was like thinking that. the yeah, same, yeah, that's yeah, right. Which, which will pay pretty well, so yeah. No, and that's when he actually started behaving himself, yeah. too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's still, you know, he's got that, uh, 
alternative side, isn't he? That, that yes. makes his, you know, broadens his appeal and everything. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. no, I actually would have loved to have seen him win the TT Sunday. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, you know, let's face it, he's going to be a strong contender this year. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So you got no more plans to race. You're all done. I'm all done now. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Too long out of it now. So yeah. I understand. Yeah. I understand. Yeah. So yeah, cool, cool talk with uh, Jason Griffith. He's never finished first, but he's placed second. Yeah, that is an accomplishment in itself in the TT.